under 3 minutes I will show you how to create amazing animations using only one sprite. To import the sprite simply drop it inside Unity. Open the sprite editor. Set the character's pivot point between his or her feet. Create an empty object named character. Drop the sprite inside the empty object. Make sure it's at 0, 0, 0 position. You will need to set up some kind of platform movement. If you want to learn how to do it under 3 minutes, check this tutorial out. Open the animation window by going to Window, Animation, Animation. Create new animation, name it Idle. Important. Press the red record button. Make sure you selected your sprite. All changes to your sprite will be recorded on the timeline as keyframes. In the middle of animation, scale the character up a little bit to give the impression of breathing. Duplicate the breathing cycle by copying pasting keyframes. Rotate the character a little bit in the middle of breathing cycles. Make sure the first and last frames of the animation are exactly the same. The idle animation is done. Create a new animation, name it Walk. Lower the position of the character on the 10th frame. Raise it up on 20th. Duplicate the cycle. Rotate character backwards on 10th frame. Rotate it forward on 40th. Make sure the frames 0, 30 and 60 are the same. Walk animation is done. Create new animation, name it Jump. On the first frame, rotate the character a little bit backwards. We are done. Open the animator window by going to Window Animation Animator. Tidy up the states. Connect all animation states with transitions. For all transitions, disable has exit time. For transitions between idle and walk, change the transition duration to 0.1. For all others, keep it at 0.25. Create two boolean parameters, is in air, is walking. Set the conditions for the transitions between idle and walk to be dependent on the is walking parameter. Is in air equals true should be the condition for both transitions going to jump. For both transitions from jump the condition should be reversed. Also let's add the condition to check if the character is walking or not. We finished setting up transitions. In your platform movement script create the variable to store the reference to animator. Assign it in the start method. Set the is in air parameter to reverse is grounded method. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, check the platform movement tutorial in the description. Check the is walking parameter to true if we have any horizontal input. Congratulations, we are done. If you want to learn more about the animations, check this tutorial out. And of course, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Have a lovely day, love you and bye bye.